the kids are having fun, getting face painted and jumping in puddles, so it's worth it. Saturday's rain did not stop hundreds of Greenwich residents from joining in the festivities at the Greenwich Town Party. The volunteer-supported event brought together local bands, vendors, and other community organizations to the Roger Sherman Baldwin Park. It's just a tremendous way for people to get together. Sometimes you're walking through the grounds here, and all of a sudden you see somebody you haven't seen in several months, and so it's a good, you know, good time for socializing, enjoying the entertainment, and just uh, it's very family friendly. The event included live music from about 12 different bands and artists. The Greenwich Town Party is becoming a really great event and you know we've we've attended the event in the last two years and thought wow what a great opportunity to get exposure to, to the Greenwich crowd and to just enjoy the event and see all the other acts and be a part of it. So we play uh, basically classic rock covers um, so it's a lot of stuff you know I, I, we used to joke that it's stuff you would see on you know a guy around our age's iPod. Nine official recognized barbecue teams can competed head-to-head -head in a grill-off. Those who attended were able to sample and vote for their favorite barbecued pulled pork and chicken. Ed Bequillen of Big Head Ed's Barbecue and Sauces tells us his inspiration behind one of his famous sauces. Sweet Naya sauce. If you knew this girl, you know exactly why she's so sweet. And she loves barbecue, don't you, sweetheart? Yes. <laughs> I designed the sauces. We have FDA approval. We bottle them in our approved craft kitchen. Residents say despite the weather, the Greenwich Town Party always owns up to its name. Besides the weather, <laughs> uh, the music, and the size, the size of it. We don't like big things. This is nice size. The family part of it, the kids. Priscilla Lombardi, it's Relevant.com.